tenth problem. The probability for a contractor to get a road contract road contract is 2 by 3 and to get a building contract a building contract building contract is 5 by 9 the probability the probability to get at least at least one contract one contract is 4 by 5 find the probability that probability that he gets both the contracts this is the problem so let me repeat the problem once again the probability for a contractor to get a road contract is 2 by 3 and to get a building contract is 5 by 9. The probability to get at least one contract is 4 by 5. Find the probability that he gets both the contracts. So that means first let us suppose that the probability for a, so that means let us consider the two events. The event of getting a contract a getting a road contract B A getting building contract B B then what is given means actually here P of A is equal to 2 by 3 given and P of B is equal to 5 by 9 given and probability of to get at least one contract means either a road contract or building contract that is P of A union B is given. So, we are asked to find out both the contracts probability that he gets the both the contract means P of A intersection B we have to find out. So, that means first you write down like this let A and B be the events for getting for getting a road contract and a building contract building contract Okay, according to the problem what is given means even probability of getting road contract P of A is equal to 2 by 3, probability of getting building contract P of B is equal to 5 by 9 and what is given means here probability of getting at least one contract means P of A union B given P 
of a union b means 4 by 5. Now by addition theorem, by addition theorem, by addition theorem or applying addition theorem, P of A union B is equal to P of A plus P of B minus P of A intersection B. So, what do you mean by P of A intersection B? P of A intersection B means probability that he get the both the contracts. So, this is 4 by 5, this is equal to 2 by 3 plus this is 5 by 9 minus P of A intersection B. So, here our aim is to determine P of A intersection B. So, bring minus P of A intersection B this side and 4 by 5 that side. So, the minus becomes plus here P of A intersection B is equal to 2 by 3 plus 5 by 9 and minus 4 by 5. So, now LCM of 3, 9, 5 that will be 45. So, now 45 write down. 3 15 ja 15 into 2 30 plus 9 5 ja 5 into 5 25 minus 5 9 ja 9 into 36. So, 55 minus 36, 55 minus 36 is 19. So, 19 by 45. So, this is the required probability. The probability that he gets both the contract is 19 by 45. This will be the answer.